that doesn't just symbolize his love but carries the weight of centuries of tradition, the hopes of ancestors and the pride of a culture. Welcome to the world of Exosa traditional waiting dress where every stitch, bead and pattern weaves a story that transcends generation. When we talk about Exosa traditional wedding attire, we are diving through a rich culture and history that stretches back centuries ago. The Exosa people, one of the largest ethnic groups in South Africa, have a deep rooted cultural heritage, and their wedding attire is one of the most visually striking and symbolic elements of their identity. The origin of the Exosa traditional dress can be traced back to the early days of the Exosa tribes, where clothing were used not only to adorn the body but to signify one's place in the society. Different patterns and beadwork were used to tell the story of who you were, your family, your clan, your social standing, and even your marital status. For brides, the traditional attire serves as a symbol of their transition into womanhood and their readiness to take on new responsibility in their marital life. At the heart of the Exosa bride's attire is the umpako. A distinctive head weaving cotton fabric traditionally dyed in shades of white with bold black stripes or geometric patterns. This fabric is not just a material, it is a symbol of purity, strength, and unity. Historically, the imbako was worn during sacred ceremonies and continues to be a core part of the Esosa wedding today, signifying the bride's connection to her heritage. But what makes the attire truly special is the beadwork. Each bead and design has a unique meaning, often conveying messages of fertility, prosperity, and production. The colorful beads are carefully selected to match the bride's family and community colors, creating a breathtaking and personalized look. For the Exosa, beadwork is more than decoration. It is a form of storytelling with every pattern and color choice holding deep significance. Some beads symbolize blessings from ancestors, while others convey well wishes for the bride's future. Exosa bride also wear the head pieces or in gear, often wrapped or adorned in beads symbolizing respect for her new rule. Ombako is a traditional attire worn by women in the Esosa culture of South Africa. This attire is commonly associated with the Eastern Cape province of South Africa, where the Esosa people are primarily located. Ombako is known for its bright color, intricate beadwork, and unique design elements Making it a popular choice for several occasions such as wedding, funeral, and other cultural celebrations. The Umbaku attire consists of several key components, including a skirt, blouse, and head scarf. The skirt is typically made of a fabric called Shue Shue, which is a printed cotton fabric with intricate designs and patterns. The blouse is usually made from a matching fabric. And it is designed with a distinctive neckline and sleeve that is often puffed or ruffled. The head scarf is also made from shui shui fabric and it is tied on in a unique style that varies depending on location and personal preference of the wearer. One of the most notable features of the Ubaku attire is the intricate beadwork that adorns the skirt and the blouse. The beadwork is often created using small glass beads. In a variety of colors, and it is arranged in intricate patterns that reflect the cultural heritage of the Exosa people. The beadwork may include symbols and motifs that have special meaning in the Exosa culture, such as cowrie shell, which represents wealth and prosperity. Mbaku is not just a fish fashion statement, it is also an expression of cultural identity and pride. Many Exosa women take great care in selecting fabric and beadwork for the Ambako attire, and they may spend months or even years preparing for special occasions. 
Khomeini is also a people in Maine, in particular wearing Mbaku is a way to honor their ancestors and connect with their cultural heritage. Mbaku has become increasingly popular in recent years, both within the Israeli community and among people of other cultures. This is due in many parts in part of the growing interest to African fashion and design, as well as increasing visibility of African cultures in the global media. Many designers have incorporated elements of Mbaku to their collections, creating modern interpretation of this traditional attire that are both stylish and respectful to the heritage of the Exusa people. Exusa Mbaku is a traditional attire that is deeply rooted in the cultural heritage of the Exusa people of South Africa. It is not for its bright colors, thin, faded, dark, and unique design element. And it is worn to special occasions to honor their ancestors and celebrate cultural heritage and identity. As African fashion continues to gain global recognition, Mbako is likely to remain a vibrant and cherished part of the Exosa cultural heritage for generations to come. If you love this video, kindly like it, share, kindly subscribe. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.